Today we do a review on this Urban Decay Lo-Fi Lip Mousse right here. So let's go and talk about the packaging. Very simple, very clean to the point. I like it a lot. So on the top right here has the name of the color, which I have is called Halo. And then on the back right here has the description about the product. And then of course on the side right here has the ingredients listed out. So when you go ahead and open this up. This is what you're going to go ahead and see. Packaging very simple, very clean to point. So on the back right here has the name of the color also along with the shade. So when you go ahead and open this up, it comes with like a really nice small size mirror. And then you can go ahead and see your product right here. And it does go ahead and come with like a little mini applicator slash like a brush for your lip product so all you do is go ahead and pull this out right here and then here's your little mini applicator so you can actually go ahead and use this applicator to apply on the lip product or you want to use your fingers so for me what I noticed is that the best way to go ahead and use this product is to go ahead and actually use your fingers so what you just want to do is um go ahead and just um, do like circular motions and then let's go ahead and apply it onto your your lips and I have to say after trying and using this product this product is actually really interesting because when you go ahead and first look at it it looks very powdery but when you go ahead and like use your fingers to like swirl it in it, it kind of like becomes like a mousse slash cream and then when you go to apply it onto your lips it's kind of like it becomes like powder again so it's like a very interesting and like a unique lip product and I have to say after trying and using this I definitely did not like like this product at all because um as you can go ahead and see the pigmentation looks really good very high but when you go ahead and apply it to your lips the pigmentation is actually a very light very low so you for sure have to do like a couple of layers and also what i know is that for those of you guys who have like chap lips um it will go ahead and enhance the lines on your lips so for those of you guys who have like dry or sensitive i would highly suggest putting on some lip balm first before you go and apply on this product or else you're you definitely go and see like your cracks and it, it doesn't look pretty you know especially when you take pictures like your lips are just like cracking it's like oh boy you know what i mean all right so and i kind of had like somewhat high expectation because you guys know urban decay does come out with like really good products but i feel like this product was kind of like a miss all right so i'm gonna go ahead and try this on <laughs> What do you guys think of this color? I would say it is a really pretty color, but I feel like this color is like not really for me. And if you were to go ahead and look at it, like from the packaging right here and match it to my lips, I feel like the color doesn't really transfer like that well since. For right here it does go ahead and look a lot more pigmented but on my lips it definitely looks like a lot lighter than it is so i feel like this lip mousse was okay <laughs> I would say um, if any of you guys are thinking about trying this, I would probably suggest you guys go ahead and skip this or maybe like go into the store and try it to see if you really like it because I definitely don't really like this product at all because first of all i don't really like using my fingers to apply on the products i feel like it's just kind of like annoying using my fingers it does go to have applicator as i mentioned before but the applicator doesn't really um apply any lip color on at all it just stays on like to the applicator which i feel like it's pretty bad anyways and aside from that i would have to say it's definitely not long lasting like if you were to eat and drink or like wipe your mouth it will go ahead and come off so you definitely do have to go ahead and touch up and i would say the one thing that i do like about this is that it does go ahead and feel very lightweight on the lips but that is it for today's video and i shall catch you guys later bye <music>